experience that Aprovecho's programs offer students is exposure to um, a full lifestyle strategy for how to live better on the earth. We have a 40 acre land trust here. It's a, uh, it's a preserve. It's, it'll exist for perpetuity on this planet. And um, we're demonstrating the most effective, most abundant, um, most restorative way to live on this site. There's been a lot written about different approaches for permaculture design and it's really exciting for me to be able to have a kind of a living laboratory to put my hands in the dirt and really see them come to fruition and see them working. I think that what APRO has going for it that makes that's, makes it unique, that's, that sets it apart from other programs, is um, that it has a really holistic approach. So you can focus on um, you know, appropriate technology and um, organic gardening and water collection systems and, you know, the political economy of food and homesteading and, yeah, it has a holistic approach that doesn't, um, you don't necessarily find in other places. I was going to college trying to figure out what I wanted to do soon to realize that what I wanted to do wasn't offered in college, <laughs> which is probably why I was so frustrated. As far as the classroom, it's different in that it's not based purely on theory. We do a lot of talk about um, theory, but then we go out into the garden and we go out into the forest and we experience and we, um, you know, get hands-on kinds of practice in what we're, we're learning about. Well, Aprovecho's programs have been happening for um, up to, you know, around 30 years. Uh, it's the longest standing sustainable living program in the Northwest. Um, it, one of the things also that I think is really exciting about Upper Vecha is that we have a 40 acre place here. It's also a, uh, a living laboratory, you know, for, for the application of these skills. Every year we, we add new systems, we in, increase our water systems, we continue our, our building development, We're adding adding cob benches and expanding the gardens, expanding the landscaping, building the soil, restoring the creek, the aquaculture system, our ferro cement rainwater catchment tank, solar hot water heater, um, ponds that capture water and, and allow us to irrigate, taking steps day by day, month by month, year by year to expand the capacity of this place and so there's a really great hands-on educational opportunity. It's an exposure to a type of lifestyle that I don't think that um, you can find in very many other places in the world. It's really unique and I think that being a part of that and seeing how it can function in a positive way, in a successful way um, that is sustainable is, is really important. Um, it's really inspiring. 